I pace back and forth along the edge of the pavement, lost in thought. The wind plays with my hair as I gaze across the empty parking lot. Cars pass quickly down the road. I hear the rumble of the rock. Outside the fence, the world goes on as I stand alone on a block. Life is a mess. It's always loud. The atmosphere is full of smog. All around, you can catch the honks from the road that traffic had clogged. I stare at the floor as I pace the ground. Images run through my head. The music rings loud in my two ears at the thoughts in my mind as they shred. I'd come to rely on the pleasing sounds of the guitars and drums in my ears. Should I dare to turn it off, I'd drown listening to my fears. I'd separated myself from the world because of pain and guilt. I'd locked myself up tight inside this fence that I had built. I stare at the fence in front of me. I was safe in this empty landscape. But still was I stuck in this land of stress. If only I could just escape. I can't explain how hard I'd tried. The orange bottles littered my shelf. I wasn't quite sure if they helped at all, but I took them in spite of myself. I loved my music. I loved how it felt to listen to someone else sing. It helped me forget where I was in my life. I could hear it clearly echoing. I showed you the way to my heart. Just follow the tracks of my tears. You promised the moon and the stars to me and left me alone to drown in my fears. I thought about what the singer had said. It lingered long in my mind. I sat down as the song played on. To the floor my head inclined. I thought of the past as the music kept playing. I couldn't help but feel that the song took the words straight out of my mouth. Its lyrics seemed so real. No warning came before the tears. I could barely see anything. I lifted my head up to the sky and I began to sing. I don't know why that song was written. But I could take a guess. My head then turned to those hidden thoughts, and I faced the wave of stress. I didn't care how bad I sounded. I sang out loud and clear. The tears flowed fast and faster yet, washing out my fears. I closed my eyes and let my emotions flow through my broken heart, submitting to the voice inside of my head that helped to tear me apart. I opened my eyes and looked around at the slots that surrounded me. They were all empty. I was alone in the place I was meant to be. What had happened was my fault alone. The blame on me made sense. I'd isolate myself from the rest of the world. That's why I built this fence. I was trapped inside this fence in this empty parking lot. I placed my hands on the strong chain links. How to escape, I thought. Back home, I knew just what to do. The bottles sat close to the blade. I turned to it when times were rough, when these pills did nothing to aid. The scars of the past linger with me still. They most likely always will. But there must be some way to move on from the past, other than a knife or pill. A new song was playing. I didn't stop singing no matter how much I cried. I squeezed the words out my trembling lips, so very hard I tried. I sat there, exhausted, a few hours later. Who knows how long it had been. I was done with this cycle of hiding and doubts. I was ready to end this scene. What kept me here was not the fence, neither a lock and key. No, I was trapped because of fear of the outside world I see. There were people to meet. There were new things to try outside that fence I had built. It was hard to leave where I'd felt so secure, but I wanted to escape my guilt. I picked up my bag and tossed it over the links of the chain wire fence. With one last look over my shoulder, I climbed up and hopped the fence. I breathed in deeply the fresh summer air as I walked down the busy street. Yes, life was loud and out of order, but in the distance I could hear birds tweet. 
It was frightening to venture away from that fence. But what's life without some excitement? Never again would I want to be trapped in my mind without any enlightenment. My view on life is a narrow keyhole. There is so much there to see. But I can't see anything beyond my limits unless I set myself free. There was no way I'd ever survive in that fence, alone with no friends around. I know there's a chance that I'll find someone else who cares and wants me around. Hey guys, so I thought Awkward Izzy here. So I hope you enjoyed the poem. I'm not going to say much to end off the video, but I do have to give a thanks to Christian Gisborne from Velvet Starlings for lending me that video and also his lyrics that were included in this poem. Those lyrics were from his song Bitter Pills. If you want to check him out and check out his music, I'm going to put his information in, in the description. I actually filmed this poem long before I finished this poem because I knew that I wanted the footage to come from this specific parking lot that I filmed at. The reason why this is is because this poem was inspired by this specific memory I have tied to my old high school and I knew that I was moving so I had to I had to get it filmed even before I finished the poem and I was like you know what even if I don't finish this poem I'm gonna use it for another poem probably Arbitrium. I'm gonna put a link to the original poem in the description if you guys want to read it I also have a bunch of other poems on my Wattpad if you would like to check them out. Thanks guys for watching, I hope to film more of, the, of these poems in the future because I really am proud of them and they're a lot of fun to make. Thanks guys for watching and peace out. <laughs>